Well, thank you for taking a few moments to talk to us this morning. Uh, first of all, who are you and what do you do? My name is Hank Rooser. I'm Vice President for Perma Pipe Oil and Gas. Uh, we're involved in the thermal installations for uh, both offshore and onshore pipelines. We have plants uh, in the U.S., Canada, Saudi Arabia, and India. Okay, brilliant. How are you finding OTC so far? Well, OTC, it's been a great show. Uh, it's been around for, I think, uh, you know, since the 60s. And it's, it's uh, you, know, you get everybody from the world, so it's a great place to uh, get an update on what's happening in the energy industry and obviously it's focusing on the offshore side of things. So it's, it's a great show. Good. And uh, what are your views on the state of the industry at the moment and going forward? Well, I think it's exciting times. Uh, we're seeing globally with uh, the oil and gas markets uh, from the standpoint of uh, we're seeing new frontiers both in the Arctic. Also now offshore, Brazil is very active, uh, West Africa, and so uh, I think we're seeing just it's a great time and uh, we're, oil and gas is not going, going to go away as people think with alternative forms of energy such as wind and solar. Still the majority of the market's going to be oil and gas, so I you know, think we need to focus on that. It's going to be a great time to go. What do you think about the shale industry? Uh, shale is interesting because it's uh, now in the U.S. Uh, there's many uh, different areas such as Bracken and Marcellus and Haynesville and other areas. And uh, I think a big part of it would be uh, getting the gas to market. And we see now the big change in the U.S. with uh, gas now going to uh, look to be exported, converted to LNG and exported. Whereas it was only about two or three years ago we were looking to import. So it's, it's very exciting. And we'll see other areas in the world as well. I think that are, are looking at the shale industry. So. Okay, and more importantly, what are the best places to eat in Houston, <laughs> would you say? Well, uh, you can't go wrong probably with some of the, the big uh, steak chains. I think Anthony's and uh, you know, there's, you know, Anthony's, Tony's, uh, there's Reef, which is a big seafood restaurant. Uh, so there's, there's a lot of great places and I'm sure you can find some, some great spots to, uh, to eat. Okay, brilliant. Right. Thank you very much. Well, thank you. Thanks. Take care.